this is a runner and this particular one has been sitting in the wood chips down there and has grown some particularly long roots which is, is great. So I just pre-made a, a hole there and just being careful with those roots. I'm going to sit that in and just cover them up up to what's called the crown. Now you do not want to cover the crown itself with dirt because if you do they tend to rot so what I'm doing here is just setting those roots in making sure that the uh, roots are in good contact with the soil and I've made a little clip uh, just out of some wire netting and bent it over and that's just going to sit on there to help the runner stay in place inside that pot but, you know it can get windy things can blow around uh, but that should hold it nicely in place and here are a couple of others that uh, I've done also and then there'll be some established ones up here which are probably ready to uh, go inside almost ready looks like that one is now all you need to do to take it out is snip the runner off from the mother plant and it's good to go because at the moment it's a little bit like an umbilical cord I guess it's it's feeding or getting nutrients having a helping hand from uh, its mother there um, but as soon as you're confident that the roots have uh, established then you can cut that runner off